Okay, so I'm in the car now to give you the update on the day. Side in the wind. Uh, he's going to go and find some beers. Um, so we had a tough day. Uh, 340 kilometres of desert road. Most of it quite unpleasant driving and very jarring. Um, it's I don't know what your uh, idea of driving in the desert is, but it's ve very corrugated, but then also very potholed and very... Th th there was one place where there was half a kilometre of quite deep sand, and so you had to just keep moving no matter no matter what. It was um, quite a challenge for Eleanor and I, but I'm very proud to say we got through it like a storm. Um, our friends Alan and Paul have blown a tire just 30 kilometers, in fact not even that, from the, um, from the camp. So after such a hard day, uh, we, we've ended up, we ended up on Tar Seal um, and they've blown a tire. Now when I say Tar Seal, um, it's Tar Seal with big uh, broken bits in it. Uh, so you, you know you'll be zooming along quite nicely at about 85 don't dare go any faster and then next thing you know their surface is just gone and there's just this big pothole that covers the entire road for about two or three meters um, so it's it, it's challenging driving but we got to camp uh, they, they are um, just erecting tents as they can it was really interesting driving through the Gobi. It's very, Andrew says that the Gobi means flat and desolate, and it is certainly that. It is, um, it, but there were parts of it that were slightly pretty. Um, and it was interesting how the sand uh, and the tones of the sand and the sand dunes changed. Sometimes it was quite orange, and then other times it was, this, there were, seemed to be what were white stones in it. Where we are at the moment, the sand is quite, well, has, certainly has a black pigment in it. Might, you can see from my hand, that's, um, you know, it's, it's nearly four o'clock now. That's from uh, three hours of driving. I washed my hands at lunchtime. So, um, yeah, it's, it's been a very long day. But this is why you're on the peak into Paris for days like this. Um, it'll be interesting to see how quickly the cars come in. Um, this sort of um, road uh, driving is very hard on the cars. You are literally bouncing all of the time. Um, and uh, so you just got to hope bits don't fall off and that everything was tightened up by the mechanics uh, yeah, the other, uh, yesterday. Um, so uh, one of the in New Zealand escorts is in already. Uh, they were zoomed past us. I'm expecting they had a pretty good day. <laughs> Uh, so it'll be interesting. Well, I'll uh, I might do a bit of video with them um, when I find them, uh, probably over a beer. All right, bye.